I am. I am. Definitely in an opponent like Marlon, like a former world champion. Um, yep, yeah, that's what I'm expecting. Definitely, yeah. That's what I'm hoping for, yeah. And I'll campaign. I'll campaign for it. Don't worry, guys. I'll be vocal and I'll campaign for it. Yeah? What do you, what do you mean by that? You mean you, you lamp up the trash talking, you're going to... I'm not going to change who I am. But um, I'll campaign, yeah. I, I, and I've had my chances. A lot, a lot of um, even the reporters there are asking me that, uh, well, they're mentioning that I didn't get a title shot because of how I approach the uh, the you know the promotion and selling the fight, um, and that's not true. You know, I've had two chances uh, with contracts in my hands, and I couldn't sign the contract because I had injuries. You know, some pretty bad injuries. Um, but anyways, um, I'll win over a guy like that. that will definitely qualify me again for the title shot. Yeah, I mean, it's, it, that's how I see it. It's, how, it's, it's, it's hard to explain how the division is right now. As you just mentioned, the champion is hurt for nobody knows the, the, how, how, for how long. TJ is trying to come down. So, again, I, th I think a win over a guy like Marla, former world champion, will definitely credit me again for... Uh, for a, for a title shot or whatever it may be. You know, depending on, on, on how everything plays out, you know, um, it depends. It really, it really depends on, on future opponents and, and obviously the result of the fight is what matters at the most for me right now. Um, but if it goes my way and everything's well, then we'll, we'll see. We'll, we'll sit down and renegotiate. Yeah, I watch sometimes, yeah, sometimes. Sometimes I record and, and watch some of the some of the highlights or whatnot. But yeah, yeah, I watch a lot. And, and what do you think of, of, of what's going on? Because a lot of people are saying that Cody, you know, a little bit of a short fuse there. Do you, what, when you see that unfolding, like, do you have a problem with maybe the way that Garbin represents the division? Or do you think that is just part of his personality and that's just how the fight game goes? Do you even, like, make that kind of personality assessment watching these things? Yeah, I don't know how... If he's doing that just out of heart, or if he's kind of forcing a little bit, um, I think he should represent a little bit better. I think he should represent the division differently. And um, you know, uh, if I had to tell him something personally, I'd say, hey, you know, I mean, I don't know. I think he should act a little bit different. And uh, yeah, the guy, the guy is a lion, you know, like a young lion. But he's not the only one, you know. He grabbed TJ by the throat and all that stuff. He, he's, not, he's not the only alpha guy out there, you know. Um, and um, sometimes the way you act, you know, the pe people might look at it where it almost like you're like the, the fake humble guy. You're humble, but you're not humble. It's like the fake humble, you know, like we say in Brazil, you know, the, the fake humble guy. Because he, he acts like he's humble and he's got all this thing going on, and then he acts like that in front of the cameras. He's not really a humble guy. Who would be a humble guy? Like, would Dominic qualify for you? Like, as that type of TJ Dillashaw is a great guy. Yeah. I like TJ. Yeah, definitely. I'm always looking. I'm always improving. And, and he's he's one thing that uh, in training, um, I'm always learning. I I think I still feel that I'm learning as a as a martial artist. Uh, when I feel that development is not coming, then I probably won't fight anymore. You know. But now. I still feel that I still feel like a young guy. Like I'm still learning every day, and, and, and martial arts is still part of my life. It's still part of my learning process. So um, every fight is gonna be different for me. Every fight is gonna be an evolving game. And looking from the past fight, yeah, I mean, I, I, I improve after each fight. You know, uh, my coaches think I look better than the last fight. If I can improve upon and add little pieces on top of the last fight, that's good for me. Yeah, I mean, the, he brings good hype, and that's good for him. I mean, he's coming to the UFC, you know, um, fighting the number, the number three guy. That's that's great, you know, that that's good. Uh, for me, it doesn't change. I mean, I don't care what, what you bring to the table, what kind of hype. Um, as far as the level of competition, I think it is different. But I think he's experienced enough to maybe adjust. I don't know. Um, I know that I can adjust, and I know I have the experience. I don't know about him. Um, 
yeah, and, and you know, uh, hopefully it plays my way, you know. Do you want to get a finish? Is it something that you care about or just the, the a W is a W no matter how it comes? No, a W is a W first of all, but I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm looking f f for the finishes. It's not as easy sometimes, but um, yeah, I'm, I'm always looking. Um, and, and to impose a little bit more, that's one of our one of our game plans to impose a little bit more on my game, and uh, and, and look for the finish.